UNO's national title in women's soccer seemed to be more a question of when would the Mavericks earn it, not if. In 2005, coach Don Klosterman and UNO were making their fourth straight appearance in the Final Four and had earned a record of 77-11-4 in the three-plus seasons before that national championship game. Led by the high-scoring trio of Beth McGill, Brandi Beal, and Amanda Iwanski, the Mavericks dominated the North Central Conference, going 11-1. From there, it was on to the NCAA Tournament, a grueling stretch of five games in three weeks. The Mavericks began by routing one of the only two teams to beat them all year, North Dakota. The 5-0 win to open NCAA play set the tone for the weekend. Iwanski had a hat trick to fuel the Mavs. Two days later, UNO posted an equally convincing 4-0 win over Minnesota State, behind two goals from McGill to advance to the regional final. Against Grand Valley State, Iwanski was again the hero, scoring both goals in a 2-0 win that sent the Mavericks to their fourth straight Final Four. But Iwanski wasn't done yet. In the national semifinal, her NCAA record seventh postseason goal was the game winner as the Mavericks came from behind to beat Franklin Pierce 2-1. Two days later, the Mavericks made history. After spotting Seattle Pacific an early 1-0 lead, the Mavericks tied the game less than three minutes later. Through regulation, the two teams would play without another goal. But in the 94th minute, Beal would net the trophy clincher, and the Mavericks celebrated their national championship.